Hey everyone, today we're going to check out a cool new string library called the Lyric Series String Quintet. This is from Kirk Hunter Studios. Um, we have five different instruments, obviously, from the quintet. We have two violins, two cellos, and one viola. Now, I have four different demos. They use the instruments in different capacities. Some of them focus on shorts and fast playing. Some of them focus on, you know, slow lyrical kind of performances. Um, so let's check it out. We use a bunch of different articulations. Then we'll go in and look at some of the features in the instrument itself. So that one tried to focus on a more performance oriented uh, kind of sporadic with showing off the different articulations from tremolo to the shorts, pizzicato, longs, legato and everything. Um, this one is another one focusing more on the long notes, the melodies and also using the portamento as well as showing off again the legato. Next, we'll look at a demo that shows off the short notes, a kind of bouncy, fun way. Um, and then the last one will be a more modern kind of sounding um, action-oriented cue. This one, however, just shows off the shorts, and it's kind of a fun, bouncy track. <laughs> And then finally, this is going to be the more action-oriented piece, a bit more modern and a bit faster tempo at 149 BPM. <laughs> Now that we've taken a listen to the four demos and kind of isolated some of the short notes there in the last one, I think the short notes are pretty well done. They're nice and crisp, um, but this library isn't really focused on short notes. So uh, let's take a look at this one and see how I created this performance. Um, this first violin here, the two violins are my favorite, especially in the higher registers. Um, so we have two different violins to choose from. They have a different tone. If you click here, you can hear about, uh, or excuse me, read about, you know, the different instruments. There are these really 
kind of priceless vintage instruments um, that they were able to sample. So you can find all about it there. Now this is the GUI. It's very simple, um, but it offers a lot of control and it's very light on resources. So here we have the violin. We have our key switches here, long tremolo, trills, st uh, spiccato, short notes, pizzicato, harmonics, and portamento. It's very easy to play and it can give you a great performance. Um, and then in that first track here, this violin doesn't use any key switches at all. It's all 100% the, um, the legato patch. So let's check out how the instrument performs, just kind of playing some random stuff. Um, going through the two different legato types as well, we have the slur during overlapping notes and then separate bowing. So it gets a totally different sound depending on which one of these you choose. And we'll check that out right now. So just by playing the instrument, you can get a very nice, realistic performance, um, which is what this instrument really strives to achieve, is to give you a very playable set of articulations. Um, you can key switch between them to do trills and trems and all that different stuff, but I think where it really shines is just taking that one long legato, and you know when you press hard, you get the short accent. You can do short notes with it. You can do fast legato. You can do slow by using the portamento. Um, for the portamento, I have it set to CC3 here. If you look down in my sequencer, when I when I do that. Um, control three here to 100% that turns on portamento and gets that nice slur and it sounds like this. So that was just a quick look for demos for the instrument as well as kind of showing you how playable uh, this instrument is. Very low on resources, very nice sound, and again, the playability is off the charts. So definitely check this one out. Don't sleep on it. Uh, the Kirk Hunter Lyric Series String Quintet. Thanks for checking in with me, and I'll see you guys next time.